subscribe to my youtube channel and click on this bell icon to get all the latest videos hello youtube welcome to my channel today a very interesting video for you if you want to make your youtube video channel or if you want to react to a particular video or a particular gameplay of yours and how it feels and how it looks and if you want to react to this particular video and you want to make a youtube channel based on to this and so keep in watching this particular video i'm making this video particular for you and i'm making this video particular for you guys i'm gonna show you how to edit your particular videos and how you can resize it position it particular video and if you want to react to this you can react using adobe premiere pro software you can edit the particular videos this is for advanced user or if you want to edit very simply and easily in one version formula software you can edit and make your reaction videos using this software and you have the nice option picture in picture video in one version film or software and you have also the same option in uh, adobe premiere pro software which is for advanced user and you also for the split screen for wondershare film order so i'm going to show you every single tips and tricks how you can make your reaction content video reaction videos and without any copyright issues and how you can change the location of it and how you can change the audio level of it and how you can change the opacity of it to look more natural and how you can avoid any copyright issue in your reaction content video so let's get it started and show you the all the things that you need to know in this particular video so let's get it started so as you can see in the this panel adobe premiere pro cc 2018 this is the total interface and the lower size as you can see this is our main timeline and the source monitor is the right right panel where you will edit and see what is going on in your video and the audio section and in the left side as you can see this is our source monitor if you drag a video from your media file this is the left corner is your media file you will add all your video content audio content add your uh, different kind of custom made transition effect color if you call out title or your intro all your videos you can drag it in your source monitor and see what's going on there suppose i'm dragging this to the source monitor as you can see if you double click this it will add in your source monitor and you can see what's going on there very smoothly and if you want to add another video suppose double click on it as you can see this is our main video where we will react okay so this is our main video where we will add our reaction videos okay so as you can see i am just making a video for you guys so that you can understand what's going on here as you can see this is the video just drag onto this and just make it smaller little smaller so that i can edit it more efficiently and smoothly and just delete the extra section that we don't want and add you can add this particular video as well and keep it in top of it as you can see you can obviously delete the extra portion which you don't want to react you can delete all of those because if you react to the whole video and upload it onto the youtube it will caught up in copyright and i just click on this button and go to the effect control panel and here you have the position scaling you can change the position scale as you can see i'm just changing the position of x y and if you go to the change the y section you can change it vertically and if you want to change the x position you can change this position to horizontally and you have the scale panel as well you can just as you can see i'm just scaling up and down and you can resize it to a corner whichever you whichever corner you want to like and just scale it up to a certain level so that your viewers can watch the video properly so just change it and give it a side and so this is a really perfect position as you can see the game is also playing and i'm also talking to the video as well if we slide it so let's see what's going on there as you can see i'm just talking to the video and also the game is also playing and so if you want to change the opacity as well go to this opacity panel and change the opacity to lower position just change the opacity as you can see i'm just changing the opacity as you can see and you can change the opacity up to 90 percent 60 or 80 percent which is fine i'm just keeping it 85 percent and if you want to change my uh, this opacity as well this video opacity you can also go there and click on the as you can see i can change the opacity of myself as well so guys as you can see in the audio section we have the two audio track one is for game and one is for my talking as you can see so if you want to uh, raise your talking level as you can see i want to increase the reaction videos or reaction sound a little more so i just right click on it and go to audio gain and from there you can add up to audio up to 3 decibel 
and as you can see we have increased our audio if you want to decrease the audio of the gameplay you can obviously do that so if, which is very important and decrease it up to minus 2 decibel or minus 3 decibel it's up to you so that you can react to the video more perfectly more purely and efficiently which looks amazing feels amazing and audio also feels good not so noisy and also your reaction will be a lot more amazing as you can see so this is how you can uh, make a video in Adobe Premiere Pro software using very simple tricks and tricks so if you want to export go to export media and wait a little bit it will take a little bit of time and from there you will select match source high bitrate and go to video section and select render at maximum depth which will make video quality awesome and change everything and use maximum render quality and uh, click on export it will be exported and if you want to do the same thing in filmora software you can also do that so i'm jealous do this in filmora software so as you can see i'm just opening the filmora software the latest version of 2018 edition as you can see this is our filmora software really easy for the beginners and uh, i suggest you to use this also which is really fast editing software for beginners and you can import the file from this here and this is your source panel where you can see what's going on in the video editing and you have the music option you can add text transition filters overlay element split screen uh, really simple easy to use and this is your timeline you can add multiple tracks up to 10 multiple video tracks and audio tracks as well so first go to media and import our media here just click on this and you can go your media for file and folders so you can do this in this way or you can drag your files as you can see I'm just dragging my intro video as well and you can drag suppose go to your particular folder and drag to your media as well from there as you can see I'm just dragging this video as well and it will take a little bit of time and I also just want to add this particular video as well as you can see we have our three particular video that I wanted added you just need to add it in your timeline and you can using zoom your timeline using this button and as you can see you can zoom in and you can add this particular video as you can see this is my particular video they want that I wanted to react and as you can see I just need to cut it off use this button to cut this section and delete the extra section and you just need to add this particular video as well you can do this very simply and easily just use it in different track and as you can see and delete the extra portion using this button you can delete the extra portion as well so just delete it and as you can see in this particular section I can see only one video because one video is underneath another video so if the same thing as Premiere Pro if I disable this video and as you can see I can see on the one video as you can see I have two videos simultaneously in different panels so I can see only one video because one is uh, after another we just need to resize it this works just like a Premiere Pro software and as you can see if I resize the particular uh, video of mine as you can see I can resize it using this button and as you can see I can resize it and as you can see this is really simple and easy tips and tricks which you can resize and keep it up to a particular size suppose I'm giving it in this size okay and I want to react to this particular gameplay or this particular game how this works and how this looks and as you can see and if I play the video as you can see I'm just talking and the gameplay is also playing and which gives a nice effect when you are making or building any reaction type of videos for any YouTube videos or if you want to upload the to YouTube you can do this very simply and easily this is a two minute job you just need to resize the second layer of your video and add it to your main reaction video and as you can see this is really simple and easy tips and tricks so this is a two minute work and add your intro fast there and easier and from there you can add any text if you want you try you can add multiple transition if you want obviously you, can, you have the option for split screen as well which I'm going to show you in this particular section you just need to click split screen as you can see you just need to add a split screen you if suppose I'm adding this this particular section and you just need to increase the size according to your video and as you can see we have two drop zone here I'm adding one drop zone here this one video and another drop zone here and as you can see if I play this now this particular section as you can see we have two videos simultaneously and whichever your reaction videos and one is your gaming videos as well 
so in this way also you can react to the particular video and make your own video content and reaction video channel as well so this is really simple and easy let's go back so that's all for guys today i'll show you everything about how you can make reaction video in in premiere pro software as you can see and also if you want to make a, a, this kind of software very easily in filmora you can do that as you can see using split screen or pip video or picture in picture video really simply and you can add up to 10 videos in different tracks as you can see so this is all i have for you guys thanks for watching and keep up to the next video and keep subscribing my channel and like comment share and share it to your friend and thanks for watching guys peace out and i will get catch up you in the next video thanks for watching bye bye